Good morning, afternoon, and evening, gamers. We're back with another episode of Koromon. So in the last one, I talked a lot about how I was really disappointed that there weren't a lot of Koromon that I could actually use. And believe it or not, uh, I was a filthy liar. Because look at the diversity in this beautiful team. So I actually did find... I was training off screen. I didn't manage to train this guy because it was really annoying. But he's a potent. His name is AC. I think is what it's called. I'm... When it comes down to, like, pixels, I'm not very good at reading. But nonetheless, he, uh... <sighs> Pardon me, he's an electric type. So, I trained everybody up to level 11, except Taruga and Fiddly. Um, they just kind of happened. But nonetheless, I... So, like, electric type, fire type, water type, ground type, and then two normal types. And I think this is about as good as we're going to get for now. There's not much, um... I did get a little bit more experience, mm. and we're just going to keep gaining all that experience. Mm. Beautiful, beautiful. Give me all them, all that extra sustenance. Ooh, what's this? A promotion bonus heal spinner. Okay, so you catch them in the heal. That's cool. That's actually really cool. I appreciate that. Pardon me, I, uh, I just had some meatballs on garlic bread because I'm crazy. And, uh, oh my gosh, what's that? I want to see what it is, though. Can I see what it is? No? Okay, game, fine. I'm only, like, 15 away. So, um, yeah, like I said, we did a little bit of training off screen. You can catch ACs, like, right in this, this, wa this uh, watershed right here. If you really want one. Me, personally, uh, we're going to go in here in just a minute. I just want to look over here real quick. Power is fascinating construct. Let's preserve it. It was built to act as a lightning rod that can store energy from bolts that hit it. Electricity has been transferred to all of Ulva. The Titan living there bends the weather, guiding thunderstorms to the island. So thanks to Volgar... It's thanks to Volgar that we'll never run out of energy. I wonder if we can catch him. I would imagine that they can't just keep talking about Volgar and not actually, like, use him. That's gonna be cool. I don't imagine that we'll be able to catch him immediately, but... Oh, hi. In this lab, we make battery packs for areas of... Uh, did I say Volva? I meant Vel Velua. I love spreading positive energy. <gasps> Nikola Tesla! Yes, we're here, Nikola! Oh, sorry. I thought you were one of those weirdos Thomas talked about on the phone. They could be anywhere. The docks in the Thunderous Cave were not safe anymore. Calm down for a moment. Can you tell me what's going on? Yeah, you're right. Breathe in. Count of four. My dear partners and colleagues, Thomas. He is being chased. To get away, he had to lock himself up in the fuse room deep within the cave. I would go and search for him myself, but I'm not exactly qualified to battle Wild Koromon. I'm lost. I don't know what to do anymore. Don't worry, I'm a battle researcher. I could do that for you. Really? Oh, that would be the world to me. But the Thunderous Cave is a dark, dangerous place. Let me help you prepare with the helmet. With integrated light, otherwise you'll surely get lost in the darkness. Also, take some of these combi as some stinky scents. Thanks. The entrance to the cave is on the beach. You can't miss it. Good luck. Electricity is just moving electrons from one place to another. If I move, then my electricity as well. Probably. Those are different kinds of buzzes. Okay. Can I, like, go in the water? I imagine one day I'll be able to go into that water. This is actually pretty cool. But they only have buzzlets. They don't have ACs, I believe is what they're called. Forgive me if I pronounce things incorrectly. I, uh, I'm special. But let's go over here. Okay, so I assume the cave's there boat here. Deep blue. Holy stream of sailing below on the hot right instead of working the lap. And goes away. Reaches to the wind. Maybe one day. Seems to be locked by electromagnets. Okay, but I have but I have an electric type. Can't I just... Eh, whatever. 
so we're going to go inside this cave. Okay, so we just kind of run around. Let's see if we can... I figured it would just be random encounters everywhere, so... So it's an armado. An armado! We'll switch into Silkwell. Silkwell, because I think Silkwell is going to be really good. I imagine he's going to evolve into Electric type, but I'm genuinely not sure. And I learned that. Well, I confirmed that Electric is weak to cut because you cut wires and it cuts the flow of electricity. At least that's the only way that I'm going to um, claim to understand it from now on. Also, how did we go from doing so much damage to doing so little damage? Did that concentrate really do so much? I would imagine not, but... Okay, so we got up and right. Let's go right. Get this beautiful item. Okay, let's see if there's anything else in here. There might be a Lunar Pup. A Lunar Pup would be really cool. I think I've already caught a Lunar. A Lumon? I did that by accident. Switch into Tin Shell because Tin Shell has a scrat, uh, cut move, cut type, uh, slish, slish, slash, taken bath move. And he's super tanky. The only reason why I have two crabs on my team is because one's really powerful and one's super tanky. Ooh. That's not a good, good thing. I think I already have a Lumon, but if I catch another one, uh, or if I see anything about it like that's improved or whatever, I'll catch another one just to be safe. But right now we're going to, because what I believe, okay, so what happened was, was that off screen, I ended up doing a little bit of training. Just, to, well, yeah, like I mentioned previously, did a little bit of training. Um, I went to a lot of different places to do training. Specifically, I went back to the forest. I can gladly show you guys, um, if you have any comments, questions, or concerns down below, and I can take a little bit of time uh, throughout the next, throughout one of the next upcoming episodes to go back and show you guys everything there. There really wasn't anything too fancy. Um, there weren't even really that many good items, if any, from what I remember. Uh, there were a few trainers that I used to get uh, extra health from, and health, extra XP from. But so far, I really like Fiddly. He, he's He's strong. Look at that. It's and it, it was. I mean, I know it's a crit, but like, oh my goodness, Fiddly, Fiddly, you hurt. Let me let me see. Oh, oh my sweetie. Oh, we're giving you all the attack, boy. You're gonna hit like a truck by the time I'm done with you. Oh my goodness. I'm probably gonna. I, I mean, unless I see something that's arguably like 20 times cooler than Fiddly, I don't think I'll ever replace Fiddly on this team. The only thing that I would probably replace next is maybe Patterbit, but Patterbit's still pretty cool. Excuse me, sir. I redeemed my gauntlet coupon. I can already feel the new gauntlet coupon. Oh, he got an upgraded one. I mean... <sighs> Let's switch into Taruga, because Taruga hurts like a truck. I mean, look at this little man. Who could really be mad at that little man? Like, if you saw that thing walking up to you on the streets, wouldn't you go and pick it up? i pick it up. I'd be like, hello there, handsome stranger. Pardon me. But yeah, I would go and I would pick him up and I would pet him like the little boy that he is. B-O-I, not B-O-I. Okay, so we're just gonna keep switch training Ace. Acey? Okay, so Fiddly. It's a different color than mine. 
let's just... Okay, so Squad will switch into Patterbit. Because Patterbit's the only one that's not affected, that's not hurt right now. But I think that that's a different type of Fiddly. Um, either potent or perfect, I would imagine. Because mine is not. Is not either. I think it's just a regular one. Or standard, as the game would call it. So we're just going to keep doing... Yeah, but for a move, for a multi-hit move, it hurts a lot. Okay, and then we're gonna do another color punch. We should be able to live one more of whatever he has to, to throw at us. I don't know what it would particularly be. Never mind. I'm a filthy liar. Don't listen to whatever I have to say ever. Um, okay, so we should be able to live one hit, one. If, you know, we weren't faster. Which we are. Okay, let's see. We're gonna make you a little bit faster. And hit just a little bit harder. Patterbit leveled up. Taruga leveled up too. Okay, so I know Houndos. Oh. That is an electric dog, which Tin Shell can handle. Because Tin Shell, as I mentioned previously, is a tank. Look at that little man. Remember when I said he was a tank? I lied. I lied. That's actually really cute. He gives him a little kiss and he's so disgusted that he just can't move as fast. It would be really cool if Houndos evolved into like an electric Cerberus that like spewed lightning instead of fire. Oh, that'd be, that'd be so dope. I would pay all my money to have one of those in real life. Oh my goodness. AC grew up to look it was. Yeah, it didn't make you stronger, but it's pretty cool, and I would definitely want one. Okay, so do I have any... How many Phoenix Shards do I have? Mm, uh, yeah, no. We're gonna... Boop. 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 Yeah, Patterpit is just down, and that's okay. I'm really not that upset about it. Let's go right first. Okay. AC's. I thought AC would be fast, just because AC looks fast. I know that you're another electric type. Recall. Let's see. Okay, so. I had originally put a Buzzlet to the team because I thought it would be it was the only electric type that I could find. And then I found AC. And AC is really cool. I like that he's just a little bolt of electricity and he's just like zoom, zoom, zam. You know? Don't bother me. I'm going ham. Zoom, zoom, bam. Mothballs again. I mean, I think that they're cool, but I already caught one um, just to catch one. Hi, homie. I heard rumors of rare color mines up ahead, so you should be prepared. Okay, so I'll definitely be prepared. The battles are definitely slower than I. I don't know what that is. It looks like a water type. It's not a water type. Is it like a poison type? It's probably 
if when, I would imagine if it's not a water type, and it's not an electric type, it would be like some sort of like poisonous gelatinous goop, I would imagine. And then Armado. Let's see how much damage we can do to an Armado. That's a lot of damage. That's also a lot of damage. It'll still one shot. I forgot Armado knows cut. We're gonna hit harder. Tinshell, as I said, is a tank. So Tinshell, you see this thing that's gonna hit you in the face? Mm -hmm. Three damage, beautiful, wonderful, illustrious. Like bow down to the almighty Tinshell because oh my goodness, he's out here. He's flexing, he's mexing, he's making you some Tex-Mex uh, chilies. He's out here, he's ready, he's Freddy. He makes you regret not going back to your Shelly. Not like the person Shelly, but like Shell because he has a shell on his back. I really felt like Humidifier would have been... So I don't know if Humidifier would, would have been a better move. Um, let's just switch in Silkwell because... Tin Shell will get rocked, but Silk will probably will not. I hope. Never mind. He hurts. He hurts bad. Um, let's send in my own. He's a little bit higher in level, and he has just as much health. Did a decent amount of damage. I mean, maybe I'll actually switch to Fury Fencer because it lets me hunt for for All right, we just need to hit twice. Hit twice and we win. Or not. Hit once. Oh, come on. Really, game? Really, you gonna hit? You gonna hit me like that? All right, I see how it is. AC, let's go. Why? Oh, thank you. I forgot to turn off my Steam notifications. So, shout out to you, Alejandro, for playing FIFA 2022. I'm not a fan. I get it. You're playing FIFA 2022. That's fine. I don't like FIFA. I don't. Well, I did. So I did, and then I didn't. It's 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 a long, complicated story. Um, okay. Let's just go down and see where it takes us. confirm because it looks like it just sent us in a circle okay so uh 
Let's go back. Because we're already really hurt, so let's just go back. like I'm blind, but I'm genuinely not sure. Oh my goodness! Oh, a hound dose. Okay, we, I can I can actually deal with this. Okay, so we have nine with the ability menacing. He's just sitting there, menacing me. Okay, so then let's do this again. And then we'll just catch him. Because honestly, like, look at him. He's such a good boy. Uno. Dos. Tres. Let's go! Nah, I don't need to look at this one right now. I'm not even gonna use him. He's just gonna... He's just gonna go to storage. Okay, I just wanted to make sure, and I'm glad that I double-checked, because now we have a hound duo. A hound... A hound... Uh, a dog. We have a dog now. Okay. So, let's go back and heal first. Before we do anything stupid. Because honestly, we need it. And while we're back, we can also double check to make sure that... Make sure that we don't have a lemon because we keep running into them. Hold up, game. I, I'm really like extremely close to using. The only reason why I don't want to use it like a stinky scent or anything like that is because you never know if you're actually gonna find like anything really good, you know. But for the sake of getting back, I think we have no choice. on Donar Island. So let's heal up, like, real quick. Because it left us right in front of the thing. Do -do -do. Before we go, before we end anything or do anything, let's withdraw. We don't have a lemon. But we'll catch one for the next time. We'll catch one for the next one. Yes, I would. Thank you. Whew. All right. Well, thank you all for watching. I will make sure to make the necessary adjustments and catch the lemon and do all of that good jazz for the next episode in preparation. Anyway, thank you all for watching, and I will see you all in the next one. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Bye-bye.